It's difficult for people to, to accept that they have a responsibility in life. Not to the community, not in the first place to the community, in the first place to themselves, to their own lives. If you consider your life to be a river flowing down, downstream, down the hill, and you're in a canoe paddling, what life would ideally like from you is two things. One is you follow the stream. Yeah? try and do something else. Secondly, it would like you to paddle now and again. You know, it would like you to make an effort and to do something rather than be carried all the time. We are carried by life, but now and again, we have to show our appreciation by doing something. So you paddle. Yeah? And then it's important to try and paddle midstream, keep your canoe midstream, rather than wanting to go to the side, step out of your canoe and have a sniff at a flower or, or pick up a rock or whatever. That's not what you're supposed to do at that moment in time. Well, if you insist on doing it, it will hurt a lot. You will be in pain, you will get ill because you disturb the balance of your life. You have the responsibility of steering your canoe. That is your responsibility in life. And that's an important one, but it means that you are responsible for where that canoe is going in the flow of life. If you insist on going to the side, you expend a lot of time and a lot of energy getting to that side while your life wants to flow further downstream. That puts you out of balance. That makes you ill. That is an imbalance, the flow of life going this way and you trying to go that way. Every person has a responsibility in their own life. And the responsibility is to try and steer your canoe in the middle of the stream as best as you can. Life tells you when it's going wrong, when you're not doing so well, then things start to hurt. Either they hurt acutely or they hurt chronically. Pay attention to it. It's a language. Your life is talking to you, right? You don't need to panic already. You don't need to run to a doctor to find out whether you're healthy or not. It hurts, okay, what am I doing in my life at this moment in time? What am I busy with? What am I trying to achieve? Maybe there is something in there that is at this moment in time not right for me or I'm not doing it right. So it's a message to evaluate your own responsibility in your life and to see if you can identify where you're expanding a lot of energy that is not actually resulting in the achievement or getting you further down the stream. Only when you realize that you have responsibility in life and therefore in health and disease only if you realize that there is that you have a responsibility to bear can you start to explore what you can do what that responsibility is and what you can do to improve your life and it's what you can do to improve your life that is going to deal with the real causes of disease and not with the said causes of disease. In other words, the environment is dangerous. Yes, if you want to see it that way, on the other, on the other hand, of course, without the input of the environment, there will be no life. Life is based on what we can bring in from the environment, whether it's water or or nutrition or sunlight or warmth or whatever. 
And still we, on the whole, consider life to be dangerous. It's only dangerous how you respond to that. Because if you are looking for the nutritious side of life and a nutritious side of your surroundings, then it's not dangerous. Then you'll benefit from that. So it's your responsibility to make that choice. Either this is dangerous, I have to stay away from that, I'll never speak to her again, and so on and so forth, or you go, what's good in life? What's good for me? Don't forget, if you want, if you want to save the earth, you have to start with yourself, not with the big planet. The planet is an entity by itself, looking after itself. You are an entity by yourself, you look after yourself. If you do that well, and your neighbor does it, and so on, so on, so on, then we'll get, we'll get all around the globe. Your responsibility is your life. And that is a very important message to everybody. So, don't forget that.